Hello friends, welcome to Priyanka's Home Kitchen. Today I am going to show you eggless chocolate cake recipe. So let's start. So here at first I am taking one and half a cup of all purpose flour and I am using this strainer to remove all big lumps. All purpose flour and also 3 tablespoon of cocoa powder this is totally unsweetened okay and also one fourth teaspoon of salt one teaspoon of baking soda just one teaspoon and one teaspoon of baking powder Okay. Now, like this. Now I am mixing this, uh, these all uh, dry ingredients together very properly. Okay, here I am taking uh, one cup of milk, and uh, this is uh, this milk is uh, in room temperature, and now I am going to add sugar in this milk so at first I'm adding um, just half a cup of powdered sugar and half a cup of brown sugar first I'm adding half a cup of powdered sugar then I'm mixing it Actually, I changed a little bit. Uh, instead of half a cup of brown sugar, here I am using just one fourth cup of brown sugar. And again, I am stirring until um, this uh, all sugar dissolves. So this is ready. Now I am adding two tablespoon of melted butter. I'm adding into this middle portion and making a uh, nice batter. Like this. Now I'm adding vanilla essence and also vinegar. Vinegar is just uh, one tablespoon. And mixing. Vinegar actually helps uh, to keep moisture in your cake because this is eggless cake. So without egg, still you have to uh, bring moisture in your cake. So, you can use uh, lemon juice also instead of vinegar. So, this is ready. And I already um, greased my pan with butter. And I preheated my oven at 325 degree Fahrenheit. So, now I am pouring this into this pan. and uh, bang on the surface so all uh, air bubbles can come out so this is ready now i am going to put it into the oven so friends after 40 minutes i took out it and you can see this is uh, totally done 
and now I will leave it for about 15 minutes to cool down so now this is uh, already cooled down so at first I am separating it from this edge like this very careful because cake is really soft okay so this is ready now very carefully you can just otherwise very carefully ah see so nice so soft so fluffy cake again I flip it because you can see this is like some oval shape so this is front side so I flip it again and uh, now for making whipped cream frosting here I am using this heavy whipping cream I added here heavy whipping cream with some sugar and now I am going to whisk it can see this is ready and you have to keep patience because usually it takes time uh, at least 15 to 20 minutes now I'm going to make chocolate frosting so for that at first I'm adding uh, one tablespoon of melted butter then one cup of milk half a cup of sugar vanilla extract and cocoa powder here I am using just one fourth cup of cocoa powder mixing well and also you have to keep uh, stirring otherwise your this chocolate frosting can burn so be careful you can see that it uh, is becoming uh, dry gradually so I mean sorry not dry I mean thicker so this is almost ready so this is ready and I will uh, leave it for a few minutes uh, for uh, cooling it and now I'm applying this chocolate frosting you can see with spoon like this so this is ready and I already uh, made my whipped cream frosting and I filled it in this bottle you can use instead of this bottle uh, just a simply ziploc bag and this type of portion you can buy from Walmart and also here I am using these uh, red you know raspberries for decorating so at first I am going to put it into the middle portion like this and then like this you can see these are looking really great very carefully so friends here is my chocolate cake see it looks really really gorgeous so friends see you with my next recipe